Every time I lay my head at night, I pray to God, watch over me, cause I ain't living right. Reminiscing how I told you that I've been hurt before. Then you hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a 2019 LE model uh, RAV4. No four cylinder. You do have the option of the Eco, the normal, the sport. You could, you know, you could put it at the S, upshift, downshift manually if you want to and i'm test driving it you know tell you guys how it feels and everything it it, it, it drives it, it drives nice it's not bad you know as for a four cylinder it it, it it you know it have all the bells and whistles you know bluetooth the lane assist i don't know if you guys can see it in the middle uh, let me zoom out a little bit can't really see because of the glare but yeah you have the lane assist everything just out here uh, of course, you know, it's basic, the LE, so it's not push to start, you're gonna have the key. But, you know, the driving, I'm so used to my Avalon, and you know, my Avalon is a V6, a 3.5 liter, so of course I'm gonna have more power, you're gonna have more power with the V6. This one, you do have power as well too, but you're not gonna have as much power as the V6, but overall, it drives nice. Uh, the number one thing about Toyota, you know, especially for the RAV4 is, uh, is reliable, you know, reliability. So it's really reliable, uh, you know, it drives nice, it drives, it drives okay. The Highlander drive better to me, but you know, the Highlander is a, it's a six cylinder, but you know, each to its own, um, you do save on gas because you're, you're in a four-cylinder motor, you know, so overall, it's not bad. It drives good. Uh, it's really hot out here. Uh, hot today. It's really hot today here in Florida. So, you know, you guys could just ride out with me. I don't, I don't really have nothing to talk about. Just to let you guys know how it drives, especially when it's in eco. You know, you probably can't see it. Or it burns less fuel when you're in eco mode you know it's not gonna put, put that much stress on the engine to pull more when you step on it it's not gonna pull more gas you know so so far so good it's decent it's nice sitting up higher because you know i'm so used to sitting lower in my car you know even though my car is a 2008 it drives really smooth really nice and it have the power as well but, um overall guys i give it i give it like a, a seven or eight out of ten you know because it's expected to drive like this due to it's a four cylinder motor you're not going to have the power you're not going to have a power in a four cylinder motor so no matter what you do how hard you try to think that it's going to be a, a powerful engine like a v6 model you're not going to feel that but um yeah guys it's a beautiful day it's nice and sunny here in florida they have the same setup you know how the new ones are the 20 the 21 same setup as the 22 you no know? yeah got the eco the sport normal mode just sitting up higher of course but uh hope you guys enjoyed this little video that i'm just trying to explain myself how it drives but as for my avalon it, my avalon drives way smoother it's just the way how you know that's the top luxury for toyota so it's going to drive smoother you know and it's of course my my Avalon is gonna be faster because it's a V6. It's like 268 horsepower. So of course. But for 2019, they did a good job on the RAV4. I'm not gonna lie. It, it drive it drive good. It's decent. It's actually better than I expected. Unlike the Corolla, the Corolla was like it's like more. It's more weaker to me. I don't know, you step on it, it struggles to move with a Corolla. 
especially when you have it in eco mode. But yeah, so far so good, guys. But uh, hope you guys enjoying y'all day. It's a beautiful day today here in Florida. And also, I like the way how they changed the the armrest right here and even the right here and over there. It's not the same material as uh, the older model, like the 15. It have like a material that irritates your arm. I'm glad that they don't make the 19 like that. I don't know about the 18, but this is a 19. They don't have that material. It's actually soft, like a softer plastic type. So it's not too bad. Uh, yeah, guys. Not bad at all, you know. So let me go floor it. It's in eco. <laughs> More like 45 right now. 50. It's just not bad, you know. Not bad in eco, you know, certain eco when you're in eco. It as I said the Corolla it struggles in eco. This one actually pull out a little faster. So Toyota did their little thing. They did their thing on this four cylinder RAV4. You know, you hear a bunch of road noise. Have the AC on, so I don't know if you guys could really hear it, but I could. But overall it's 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 nice. It's not bad and one thing you don't want to have a vehicle when it age you end up with a lot of problems you don't want that so toyota keep doing their thing you know building cars to build to last and less money on your on, on the pockets you know less 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 work on the pockets you don't want to spend have a vehicle and keep on spending spending to fix every time as the vehicle age you want a car that that's reliable you know take you from a to b to from a all the way to z you know you need a vehicle like that that's why one thing with toyota they they make their cars reliable but yeah guys this is all i have to share with you today now until i upload another video this is a 20 2019 you know le model so you got the key you know <laughs> it's not push to start that i'm used to even though my avalon is push to start but hey it is what it is you know down here you have a, a power cord you have an ox you have a usb down there you know two cup holders right there yeah you got this menu right here that show you how your fuel con consumption is so this uh spark that's in front of me need to speed up <laughs> for real i'm going to 42 right now i think the speed limit is like 45 or 50. but yeah the ac blow nice you know everything works it's not bad i like the way how it sit sit up high i like the way you know sit up high it drives nice it's decent for a four cylinder motor vehicle but i'm gonna cut this video right here guys thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe tell me what you think you know have you ever uh test drive the rav4 have you think about getting the rav4 you know they have the the xle the one that's pushed to start the one that's uh fully fully loaded you have more get even more features and stuff push to start and stuff you know this one is not bad this one do have a lot of features as well it's the same setup but the the fully model one have the keyless entry and all the extra bells and whistles and stuff you know the apps and stuff the phone the apps the track the seek uh home menu audio maps yeah got the settings in the steering wheel different option menu you can change that go to the side you know the distance shows everything you know 
yeah but um i'm gonna cut it here guys i rate this from eight eight out of ten not bad just the way how it drives just to be a four cylinder car and because i have it in eco you know it don't really i don't feel it has it hesitated a little bit to move off in eco but that's expected for four cylinder motor but it still pick up speed and thank you guys for watching please like subscribe i really appreciate the love and support peace out bye bye take care god bless Get into the money, get into the money, get into it. Get into the money, get into the money, get into it. Get into the money, get into the money, get into it. Get into the money, get into the money.